Hey, what's up guys, it's Rob Stark. And in today's video, what I have is a massive box opening. I saved up all my coins over the past, I don't know, month, month and a half, something like that. I've been waiting for the update to drop. That way I can open up all my boxes at once and see if I can get the new brawlers. All right, so this is, it's going on in the background right now. And I'm just gonna speed it up because I opened, I ended up opening around 100, or a little over 100 just from coins. And then I don't know if you guys saw them, but in the shop they have these, I think they're called big brawl boxes where you can get 10 boxes for 80 gems. I opened up two of those. So overall, I ended up opening 127 boxes. And you guys are gonna have to see the end results. I'm gonna put up during the video, there's gonna be a little part for the stats. You, maybe you already see it. Um, yeah, so overall, from the 127 boxes, I ended up getting 85 chips and 95 elixir. And part of the reason I wanted to do this too is so I could see the new drop rates. And actually what I did, or what I'm gonna do, is I'm gathering data from some of my friends and clan mates, and they're telling me what they're getting from their box openings. So I'm also gonna have, I'm gonna combine their data with mine and give you the overall drop chances from all the different boxes. And from, but from my stats alone, I got 52, you know, one chips. I got one chip 52 times. Uh, and that was about 41% of the time. And then I got two chips seven times. Um, three chips three times. I'm just gonna, I'm not gonna read through them all. I also don't wanna spoil all the surprises. But man, I'll tell you what guys, I opened up so many boxes. And I don't know, I got a lot of elixir to show for it. But man, as you'll see pretty soon here, I did not get Pam and I didn't get Tara either. I was really disappointed. I ended up having to buy them with chips. I had the chips and I'm already somewhat of a dirty gemmer so I just went ahead and bought them. And I actually do end up, I don't gem them to max in this video, but I do end up pretty much gemming them to max. Terra's at 14 elixir, but who's counting, right? All right, so I compiled all the data from my box openings and my friend's box openings, and I put it all together, and I found the percent chance of your drop for each chip, for each elixir, for the coin things. So what I found is basically for the one chip or any common brawler, you have about a 42 or 43% chance, and then it goes a lot down from there for the rare brawlers, you have about a 4% chance. The super rare, it's uh, about one and a half. Epic, it's about one. Um, I messed up on the, uh, the display, but for the mythic and legendary, it's you know under half a percent by a good amount. Um, and then for the elixir, you have about a 35% chance of one elixir, 8% chance of two, etc., etc. So those are all pretty low. And then the coin boosts are also pretty low as well. Yeah, but I hope you guys found that interesting. Uh, thanks for watching my video. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll catch you later.